क्वेश्चन सिक्स सेज रीटा गोज ट्वेंटी किलोमीटर्स टूवर्ड्स ईस्ट फ्रॉम अ पॉइंट ए टू द पॉइंट बी फ्रॉम बी शी मूव्स थर्टी किलोमीटर्स टूवर्ड्स वेस्ट अलॉन्ग द सेम रोड एंड वी आर ऑल्सो गिवन दिस फिगर एज पार्ट ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम सो लेट्स ड्रॉ हर जर्नी ऑन दिस फिगर दैट इज गिवन सो फर्स्ट रीटा गोज ट्वेंटी किलोमीटर्स ईस्ट फ्रॉम दिस पॉइंट ए टू दिस पॉइंट B. So we can represent this part of the journey by drawing an arrow from A to B, and this is twenty kilometers. Then she goes from B. Uh, from B, she moves thirty kilometers towards the west. So from B, she will move towards the west, and let's say that she ends up at this point here. Let's call this point C. so this part of the journey is 30 kilometers long so this is how rita has moved then the problem statement says if the distance towards east is represented by a positive integer then how will you represent the distance traveled towards west and then by which integer will you represent her final position from a okay so we are told that any distance traveled towards the east is represented using a positive integer so let's write this piece of the information so any distance traveled towards the east direction is represented using a positive integer so positive integer and in this case because rita has traveled 20 kilometers east from a to b so we will write this part of the journey we will represent this distance covered as plus 20 kilometers now this means that any distance traveled towards the west has to be represented using a negative integer since the west direction is the opposite direction of the east direction and we are taking distances in the east direction as positive okay so we can say that any distance traveled towards west we will we can represent this using a negative integer and in this case because rita traveled from b to c she traveled a distance of 30 kilometers towards the west we can represent this distance covered as minus 30 kilometers so the first part of our answer is that any distance traveled towards the west can be represented using a negative integer now let's come to the second question on rita's final position so the question is by which integer will you represent her final position from a so let's write an expression for her final position so we can say that the final position will be whatever is the initial position and then uh, whatever is the change in position because of the travel from a to b so change due to the travel from a to b and then whatever is the change in position due to the travel from b to c okay so the change from b to c so now let's assume that the initial position which is this point a let's represent this as 0 km on the number line okay so the initial position is 0 kilometers then the change uh, in going from a to b is plus 20 kilometers so we will say that we add plus 20 kilometers and then the change due to the travel from b to c will be minus 30 kilometers so we add minus 30 kilometers so this is the expression that we will get for the final position so we ignore 0 kilometers and we get 20 kilometers and plus minus 30 kilometers so we can write this as minus 30 kilometers so 20 minus 30 is minus 10 so we get the final position as minus 10 kilometers which basically means that the final position is towards the west of a because if the dis if uh, the position is negative this means that the final position which is this point c it is to the left of a as we can see in this figure so the second part of the answer is that the final position can be represented as minus 10 kilometers okay and this completes question number 
To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.